In the early 20th century, the fires of revival began raging across North America. Multitudes of people were saved and brought into the kingdom. Many began to hunger for healing and the deeper works of God. Yet over time, this revival began to wane, and many wondered if there would ever be another season of outpouring. In 1946, an unusually gifted evangelist arose, William Marion Branham. He was not only gifted in praying for the sick, but God also used him to make prophetic utterances. News about his meetings spread all over, and soon many other evangelists and leaders wanted to follow in his footsteps. Oral Roberts, A. E. Allen, and Jack Cole were three of the most notable followers. Many others began to pack people into large canvas tents. Thousands came to experience the move of God. They hungered to see the sights, to encounter the wonders, and to experience healing. Many believed that the Pentecostal revival was being reignited that what was known in previous generations was being known once again. Many began to experience the power of God and give reports of tremendous healings. People began to leave behind back braces. Women and children who were being left for dead were suddenly being strengthened or renewed. People left behind crutches, canes, wheelchairs. Medical devices were no longer needed as people were experiencing breakthrough. The wonder and glory had restored the imagination of the masses, and Jesus was being glorified. This inspiring story and many others has been documented in my book series, Regeneration, A Complete History of Healing in the Christian Church. This series has been endorsed by Randy Clark and a number of other notable evangelists and theologians like Craig Keener. This book series is now available and you can find it on Amazon.com or TheResurgentStore.com.